now time to get to another live performance from a man who is part of the family as well. Uh, his work with his band Rough Cut, and of course uh, a one-time member of Quiet Riot as well. Performing one of Ronnie's favorite John Lennon songs, please welcome Paul Shortino. How's everybody doing? I'd just like to say a few things from my heart. I remember, uh, it's gonna be hard. I remember uh, meeting Ronnie and Wendy for the first time. Uh, they came down and uh, checked out a band that I was playing with. And at that time, I also was playing with Claude Snell, putting a project together that ended up being rough cut. And I always had this problem, and I always believed everything that everybody told me, so I always was signing every freaking contract they made. So I signed this contract without reading it, of course, and Ronnie and Wendy came to my rescue. They not only came to my rescue, but they moved me in so I wouldn't sign any more contracts. <laughs> I can remember every morning just waking up and making them both hot tea and English muffins for breakfast. And being very careful that Nietzsche, the German Shepherd, didn't take my hind end off because uh, she liked to bite people. But as time went on, uh, I got to meet the rest of the gang. Angelo Curry, which uh, was Ronnie's engineer for the first couple albums, maybe the first three albums. Vinny Abbasi, Vivian, Jimmy Bain. I remember them uh, sitting down and putting the album together for the first Holy Diver album, the artwork. Hearing Holy Diver and uh, Rainbow in the Dark, Ronnie coming home at night and sharing the, the stuff they did in the studio. And I'm really gonna miss him, just like you all are. Yeah. He's a hard person not to love. We love you, Ronnie. I chose a song that uh, isn't uh, from the Dio catalog because everybody chose one song that I'd like to do anyway. So I figured I'd do a song from another great artist in our time, John Lennon. Because when we lost John Lennon, we lost a great talent, just like we lost Ronnie James Dio. A great talent and a great human being. So this is going out to you, Ron. Hope I can get through it. <laughs> there are places I remember all my life, though some have changed, some forever. Not for better, some have gone, and some remain. All these faces have their meanings of lovers and friends. I still recall some are dead and some are living. In my life, Ronnie, I loved you more. But of all these friends in love, there was no one to best to you. And these memories lose their meaning. When I think of love as something new, though I never, ever, ever lose affection for people and things that went before, though I know I'll never, ever forget. 
forget about you and my love. I've loved you more. And as Ronnie would say to all you fans out there, in my 